The push continues to get more people vaccinated against coronavirus. Tonight, Dr. Maria Simmer reports on some insight into why so many people are hesitating. 50% of Americans have received at least one dose of COVID-19 vaccine, and 40% are fully vaccinated. They have their reasons for getting their shots. Just to protect my family and friends and just to kind of get back to some sense of normalcy. Because I work as a nurse at Passman Hospital, I was able to get the vaccine first. I think it's the socially responsible thing to do. People who remain unvaccinated also have their reasons. To look at this more closely, the Kaiser Family Foundation polled 1,500 people. Of those holding out, one in three is waiting for full FDA approval. Dr. Amy Crawford Fauche says sometimes there's confusion about what EUA means. The emergency use authorization is emergency use authorization, not experimental use authorization, because sometimes that acronym gets, you know, misused. One in five unvaccinated people would like paid time off to get the shots. I think if a company values having a person vaccinated, then that's a wonderful conversation for them to have with their with their company. One in 10 would be motivated by financial incentives. The value of getting as many people vaccinated as possible is so high that I say, hey, try these things. What hasn't worked as motivation, the CDC's guidelines saying masks can come off indoors for those fully vaccinated. A notable finding, 40% of those not considering immunization feel pressured by the government, the media, society, and friends and family. I think we're at the stage of vaccination now that it's going gonna, it's gonna to rely on one-to-one -one conversations with trusted people. Dr. Crawford Fauche says she clarifies any misconceptions, but doesn't force. You know what? No pressure. You need to come to this decision by yourself. The vaccine's here waiting for you when you want it. Family can be persuasive, though. I did have a patient who was never got any vaccines, but his uh, pregnant daughter said, well, you're not seeing my baby until you get your COVID vaccine. Because of that, he got his vaccine. I'm Dr. Maria Simbra, KDKA News.